He's back. It's a great day, ladies and gentlemen. Gonna drop music. Man, I needed this, bro. I needed it. I didn't even know the nigga was dropping. But I'm very happy that he did. The album is called A Gift and a Curse. 15 songs, 45 minutes. I tuned in. And now, as usual, man, it's time for a little quick review. And yeah. Yeah, this shit is gas. Yeah, nah, Gunna went crazy on this one. To me, this is his best album since Drip Season 3. Bopping the shit out of my head while listening to it. A lot of standout songs. Most of the album was pretty good. It was two songs I didn't like, and then the last four songs were like okay to me. Like, if these four were not here, this album would be top as the fuck. But yeah, the songs I don't like. I don't like Born Rich. That shit is ass to me. And then I first didn't like I Don't Know No More. But on the second listen, it grew on me, so I don't know. I could see myself fucking with but it. But fuck them songs. Let's talk about the bangers. My favorite three songs would have to be go crazy that shit is damn near a top 10 gunner song i've ever heard rodeo and then p angels but i'm not gonna lie p angels sounds a whole lot like hard to choose one by future i'm sky at me i'm back out of chain took a few lessons that's part of the game get a big jet to my talent to spain right right like that's that's p angels hold in the back with a truck in the front smoking on gas and five in the blunt Popping new tags is one over one. Literally the exact same fucking flow. But I mean, both are very hard. Other notable songs, Back to the Moon, Cash Shit, Fuck You Mean, Back At It. And yeah, those are probably the ones I like the most. Yeah, nah, this album was tough. Not the best fucking album this year. But it's definitely up there. I like Gunna's beat selection a lot on this album. He was on some different shit and just the shit he was talking about. He started to rap with like substance. Talking about actual things. Even though I could really care less if he does that or not. The nigga flow is so tough. He could talk about dirt for like two minutes and make that shit sound tough. Good comeback album. I rated like a 9.1. I think he went 14 for 15, but I wouldn't listen to all 14. More like 11. Yeah, bro, man. Gun is back, man. What y'all think? Do you agree? Do you disagree? Did I piss you off? Did I make you happy? Just let let me let me know.